the question was, how was the matchup with Alex Morgan today, and how did she threaten your back line? Okay. Alex Morgan is always, like, a good player, and then she tried to play really tough with the back line. But I think we also did a, a great job to try to shut her down and not let her have a lot of the ball and then do her best. That is like finishy and headers. And I think we did a, a really good job to to delay her a little bit. We'll go to Jessica Soup. Houston, Aga was just on talking, she spoke a lot about defending. And I'm just wondering, from a player perspective, if you feel like that's been a big difference or a shift uh, in, in the time that she's been the coach, that there's been that much more emphasis on defending maybe than in previous coaching eras. Yeah, I think, of course, like we have a lot of to, to build, and then we are not totally ready yet. But I think we have been learning a lot since Pia came, and then she wants us to be more aggressive. She wants us to defend as a whole team, not just like the back four. And that's really important. We keep in our mind all these details so we can get better every day and then be ready in the Olympic Games. We'll go to Alonzo Contreras. Can I ask in Portuguese, right? Yeah. Okay. O que achou do jogo de hoje contra um grande time como Estados Unidos? Can I answer in Portuguese too? Eu achei que foi um jogo muito disputado. As duas equipes tiveram boas chances é de marcar gols. É claro que os Estados Unidos colocou uma intensidade no início do jogo muito grande e a gente tentou ali segurá-las na, na medida do possível, elas acabaram conseguindo achar um gol, e, mas mesmo assim a gente conseguiu é, se manter, conseguiu ir para cima, tivemos boas chances é, de gols, infelizmente acabamos não concretizando, né, não marcando, mas o nosso segundo tempo também foi, foi muito bom, Eu acho que a Pia vai conseguir tirar grandes lições desse jogo e passar para a gente, para que a gente possa continuar crescendo e... Eu vejo que depois de um grande jogo desse, estou muito orgulhosa de cada atleta é, da seleção, de cada comissão técnica, e vejo que a gente está no, no caminho certo. E agora é continuar trabalhando para que a gente possa corrigir os, os detalhes né, que, foram, que não foram tão bons, que a gente possa melhorar na nossa criação de jogadas e, e assim continuar trabalhando para que a gente possa estar cada vez mais preparadas. Thank you. Uh, hi, Tamilis. Hi. What can you say it changed? Uh, what can you say changed in the second half from the first half when Brazil looked more in control of the game? Thank yeah. you. I think in the first half we were a little bit like dispossessed, and in the second half we keep like the possessed. We were more compact so we could create more chance. We are not like playing so much long balls. We were trying to, to connect passes, and that was how we create some really good chances. And I think we, the back four was also like really compact to, to shut them down. And then, in, yeah, I think the players that came in during the second half, they also came in, in really well, so they make the difference and they keep the, the team like going up, going strong, and that was really good too. So for me it was like the first half we were a little bit dispossessed and then the second half we were more compact and then create chances like connecting passes between us and that's the, the, the difference for me. And we'll go final question to Jose Ramon. Hi, Elena. Uh, what do you think Brazil like that she's playing a good game overall? What do I think Brazil? Can you repeat, please? Sí. Uh, 
What do you think Brazil Lakers they keep playing a good game overall? Yeah, I think we did. We we played a good game. Of course we when we lost a game, it's like soccer is always about goals. If we score, we you win. So but I think we really have like good chances. We build up really good. Uh, we create some really good chances, and that is what we can take from positive things for us. And then we, of course, need to score in those chances because in, because in big ch uh, games like that, if you have a chance, you just have to put it in. And that that was the detail that we missed today. But like I said, we need to keep working hard. We need to know that the Brazilian shirt means a lot to us. And then we, this is like uh, Brazil, it's always strong. It's always going to be strong. So we need to work hard to get where we want to be. Thank you very much, Tamiris.